fireworks before the White Sox and Rangers even took the field during the exchange of lineup cards. Jerry Lane ejecting Chicago bench coach Mark Parent. Parent perhaps voicing frustration over controversial calls which went against Chicago in the first two games of the series. Pick it up bottom three. Matt Garza starting for Texas, facing Gordon Beckham second and third one away. There's Beckham with two aboard. Here's a swing of the line drive center field. Gentry going back, makes the play. And no, off his glove to the wall. It's going to roll. Home with no problem. Viciato chugging around Fagley. No throw. 2 nothing Sox. WSCR on the call. It's ruled a sack fly and an error. Let's go top four. It is John Danks on the hill for Chicago. Facing Jeff Baker, one on and one down. Baker high and deep into right. Avisayo Garcia crashing into the wall as the ball clears the fence for a game-tying two-run shot to make it 2-2, and Garcia had to leave this game. Replacing Garcia in right was Jordan Danks, John's brother, as he now faces Garza bottom four. Curveball lifted high and deep towards right field. Rios goes back to the warning track, looks up, and it's gone! Danks on an 0-1 pitch. Hooks a pitch up out of here. 3-2 Chicago WSCR once again, according to Elias. First time since 1955 that a player has hit a home run in support of his brother, the starting pitcher. Now we go top five. It is John Danks in a first and third one-out jam facing Adrian Beltre. Line shot, Jeff Kepinger's got it. Steps on the bag to double up Elvis Andrews. Danks six innings of two-run ball on Sunday. Bottom six, man at second for Adam Dunn. A little insurance right here. Ribby single into right. Alexei Ramirez scores. It's 4-2 Chicago. Top seven, Matt Lindstrom in a bases loaded one out jam facing Beltre. And Adrian's tough day continues. A 5-4-3 double play. Lindstrom gets out of trouble. Bottom seven now. Garza still out there. Josh Fegley greets him with a solo shot into left field. Number four for Fegley. 5-2 Chicago. And that was your final on Sunday as the White Sox have now won eight of nine. Matt Garza took the loss after yielding five runs, four earned in seven innings. He's allowed at least four runs in each of his last five starts. Avisayo Garcia's injury also put a tough luck end to his 11-game hitting streak as he struck out in his only at-bat of the day. Garcia underwent testing after the game for a concussion, but it came back negative.